The first event features the 100 butterfly, which is Matt Biondi's chance to win his second medal in, sec in his second event. Matt Biondi's a superstar in swimming, in the water and out. Nobody handles the pressure better. Anthony Nesty is a very confident young swimmer and a very good one. He's from a little country called Suriname, which is on the north coast of South America. Of course, if uh, he wins, he'll be the first guy for even medals. He'll be the first to win a medal in swimming for Suriname. Matt Biondi was slow to the box. Andy Jameson got there right away. First 50 was set up perfectly. Um, I had a good turn, and, uh, and uh, I knew 75 meters to the wall. I, th I, mean, I was pretty confident that I would. I was going to get a third. They now have 10 minutes to swim. Matt Biondi going for the goal. John Sieben coming hot on the outside. But Biondi looks like he's going to take it to the wall. And they get Nesty finally takes it in lane three at the very last moment. And Nesty, that powerful little swimmer from Suriname, found a way and he beat out Biondi in the very last stroke of this race. It's like uh, a dream come true, especially from a guy from Suriname going at that big stage um, and, and performing at that level. You know, when I was growing up, that was the story because the guy he beat wasn't just any other guy. He was supposed to be the next Mark Spitz, and, uh, and so it was a huge upset. And it, you know, I think everyone in America back then remembers that race because of that. You know, when you get to that level, you're, you're like, you know, you, you did it. So. Uh, Great moment for me, my family, and uh, you know, also great mo moment for Suriname. You know, we're a third world country. You know, economically, we weren't doing so well, so a lot of a lot of struggles. 53 seconds um, changed all that. It was a very prideful moment for Suriname because uh, those 53 seconds, everybody for forgot about all the, the struggles, and uh, they put that behind them, and they really celebrated the fact that uh, one of them made it to the highest level of swimming. But today, the biggest man in the nation of Suriname is five foot 10 inch Anthony Nesty. Olympic gold in a 100 meter butterfly. You can have the biggest dreams, believe in those dreams, because you never know it may come true. And in my case, it did. From a guy from Suriname to say that, uh, <laughs> I think it's just a testimony that uh, anybody can get there.